let us learn how to check a number whether it is divisible by 17 or not without actually dividing it. This can be done in just two steps. So let's get started with the first example. Is 5882 divisible by 17? So the given number is 5882. In this, then take the last digit. Our first step is take the last digit and multiply with 5. The product is 10. So subtract this 10 from the rest of the number 588. So 588 minus 10. We have to subtract the product from the rest of the number other than the last digit. Okay. So the result is 578. Now let us check whether this 578 is divisible by 17 or not. If you are not sure whether it is divisible by 17 or not, so we are going to repeat the same process of first step again. So let us take 578 now as our number and take the last digit of that number 8 and multiply with 5 again. So after multiplying with 5 you are getting 40. So remove this 40 from the rest of the number this 57. So 57 minus 40 gives you 17. So we got an answer which is exactly divisible by 17. So we know that 17 is divisible by 17. So if you are getting a number which is divisible by 17, then we can conclude that the number given number 5882 is also divisible by 17. So let us check with the another example, little bit bigger number. So let us take the next example. Is 41769 divisible by 17? So according to our first step in the previous example we have learned take the last digit of the number 9 and multiply with 5 gives you 45 now take this 45 the product and remove from the rest of the number so the rest of the number other than the last digit is 4176 subtract 45 from this so we will get 4131 so let us check this is divisible by 17 or not. So if we are not sure about it is divisible by 17 or not directly, then you have to repeat the same process again. So take the last digit of the number. Here the last digit of the number is 1 and multiply with 5 again. So 1 into 5 gives you 5. So remove this 5 from 413. So let us take the rest of the number other than the last digit is 413. Remove, I mean subtract 5 from this. So, we will get 408. Now, is this divisible by 17 or not? Still, we are not sure about this. So, let us take, repeat the same process. Take the number 408 and take the last digit of this number 8 and multiply again with 5. So, we are getting 40. So, remove this 40 from the rest of the number other than the last digit. So, 40 minus 40. So, which is nothing but 0. So, whether you are getting a 0 or a number which is divisible by 17, then you can say that our given number is divisible by 17. So, here the result is 0 which is divisible by 17. 0 is divisible by any number actually. So, we can conclude that 41769 is also divisible by 17.